Wow, what a pair. This is Google over on my left and Yaya on who's standing on my right. They're beautiful Siberian Huskies. Google's ID number at the Baldwin Park Shelter is A5108570. <laughs> well, there's one who's really unfriendly. And <laughs> That's Google. And Yaya's ID number is A5108556. They are both about two years old. Uh, they came in as owner surrender on September 7th, which was yesterday. Uh, they are victims of a divorce. I guess the people couldn't decide who got who, so they both, they both get lost. Um, they are beautiful, beautiful dogs, both of them. Google has the dual eye, the one, one brown, one, uh, one blue, and uh, Yaya has both brown. They are gorgeous girls. Uh, Google's a little bit smaller at 46 pounds, Yaya's about 58. Uh, Jana, tell us about Google. Okay, so Google is very submissive, very sweet. He, she likes to get on her back for belly rubs very quickly. She's very, as you can see, they're very attached to each other. I don't know what's going on. Their ears had some flea strikes, so yeah. it doesn't seem like they've had the best care, and so they really kind of latch on to each other for, for comfort. Um, but she is very, very sweet, very affectionate, both of them are. Um, but they both, they just feel like they haven't had a lot of training or socialization, so it could have been backyard dogs. Yeah. Uh, but I think once they're in a family, they're going to they're gonna fit in well. They just need proper socialization and uh, yeah. obedience training and right. exercise because they're huskies. Yeah, because they're huskies. Yeah, those ears, I mean, they tell you that they were, they really give a indi strong indication that they were simply left out in the backyard. So, uh, Diane, what can you tell us about Yaya's personality? Yeah, so Yaya, she's... Uh, Sure. She, she's. Not, I wouldn't call her submissive. Uh -huh. So maybe she's the big sister. Could be. Yeah. And uh, she's very. She's really very sweet. She's. She's uh, paying attention to everything, you know. So she's a little bit on alert here, I think. But it's the situation. So. Well, they've only yeah. been here two days, so they're. Yeah, they're, uh, they're, they're one day. They're. Out. They're yeah. really. Yeah. Considering that, they're doing quite well, and maybe because they have each other. Are they kenneled together? They are kenneled yeah. together, so obviously, so that's a great you know, comfort. it would be great to have them adopted out together, but if they're adopted separately, the you know, main purpose is to get them out, and, and if they are separate, then they'll learn to kind of be strong on their own. Exactly, but. exactly. You know, it's I hate owner surrenders always, but it, maybe these these girls will be better off somewhere yeah. else. I mean, they really should be part of a family, uh, you know, sitting in your living room with you, watching TV, and going on walks and hikes and uh, you know it's just not fair to lock chain them up in the backyard and expect them to you know be healthy socially acceptable dogs they just haven't been socialized at all there but they're so sweet they that's are. They, darling the longer they're out I'm really falling in love with their little personalities because they are so gentle they yeah. just they don't know what to, they don't know what to do no but they're very very connected they're not aloof like huskies can be sometimes they are, aren't they? It's interesting. They, they, just see, they just seem like family dogs, don't they? Like they'd be yeah. great with a, with a family. They're so nice. Well, you know, if you got room in your home and your heart for two of them, this would be fabulous. They would sure like it, huh? Yeah. But even one at a time, they, need, they both need a fresh start. And <laughs> yes, oh, look how pretty you are. You are both gorgeous, both of you. This is Google, and this is Yaya, and they're at the Baldwin Park Shelter. Please come and get them, one or both. Bye, Bye babies. What nice dogs.